What's up, you guys? It's your good girlfriend, T, with the T and her tiny microphone, and I'm here with... Bankroll Big. What's happening? What's up, Bankroll Big? So, tell me, um, where you get that name from? Shit, I got the name. My partner used to call me Big, and then I'm all about a bankroll, so... Bankroll Big, I just put that shit together and made it, made it my rap name. Okay. So, when did you start, like, rapping? Uh, I've been knowing how to rap for a minute, but I just started taking this shit serious probably about... Right, uh, like right before Corona hit, I started accumulating songs, and then when when Corona was over, I just kind of like mastermind dropping my own shit. So I've been serious about a year and a half, like serious, serious. Okay, so would you say it was like uh, for jokes or like um, a hobby you were trying to get back into? Like, did, have you always been like musically inclined or what? Yeah, I've, I've been musically inclined. Uh, I I can, I can honestly say it probably was a habit at first because. You know, I wasn't focusing on myself, but when I started thinking about investing in myself, it really became a business then. That's when I started putting a plan together, started coming up with ideas and shit, marketing and shit. Now my song playing, I'm about to, I gotta go perform right quick. Oh shit, y'all, well, right. we'll be back, y'all. All right, go ahead. What's up, you guys? It's your girl T with a T and her tiny microphone, and we are back with Bankroll Big. Yeah, I said man. it right, right? Okay. So, yeah, y'all, like, he went and performed or whatever. He a little hot. It was, you know what I'm saying? Hot and bothered. It was good. So, yeah, how man. was it? Shit, man, it was amazing, man. I love the energy just then, the intimate shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm an intimate nigga. So, being intimate like that, it, it, it you know, it's, it's too familiar for me. So, tell me about the songs he performed. Songs Jazz Sport is a um it's a record that I dropped that's that's real big to me um the people the fans like everybody like they they showed me what that record was I knew what it was but when I dropped it the people showed me what it was it's, it's, it's unique how we came up with it and the song is catchy you know what I'm saying it's rats inside the Jazz Sport so I'm all about a bag so you know that song really mean a lot to me um. The ain't going broke song, man. You know, it's just a hustler mindset. I can't go broke, man. We ain't going broke. I don't, I don't, it don't matter. By any means necessary, we're going to get it. You know what I'm saying? So that that's the other part of me. That's me by myself. I ain't going broke. That's swagged out. That's me. Bankroll big. So, yeah, where you from? Like, I don't think I don't think I caught where you from. I'm from Atlanta. Atlanta. What you doing up here in the Carolinas, though? I'm in the Carolinas. I'm at work right now. You know what I'm saying? Like Atlanta home. So when I go back there, I'm going to be sleeping. But outside of that, man, when I pull up everywhere else, man, I'm at work. And shit, from Carolina to Calif California. So, you know, I'm working right now. I'm beating the streets up. The whole Southeastern Conference. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting my bag. I'm beating it up. I'm networking. I'm grinding. You know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm doing what I got to do. Okay. So where would you say that your inspiration for your music came from? Uh, my inspiration for music came from, um, I've been musically inclined. I, I, I listen to, you know, a lot of different people growing up. So, you know, I've been inspired by music. Um, I feel like as far as me being an artist, I think uh, me starting a business. I, I feel like jumping into business is what opened the doors, doors for me to expose myself as an artist because learning the business, I'm a student. So as a businessman, I'm learning, I'm learning, I'm learning. So I see what it takes to be an artist. You know what I'm saying? I learned like what, you know, the, the ins and out. And then once I learned that, shit, now I can apply it. You know what I'm saying? After that, it's just about doing it and um, having a, you know, good sound that, you know, people like. So so um, what artists would you say inspire you the most? Uh, the most, man, business-wise, Say boy, Hove, Hove. Um, I like, I like, I like Nipsey. Nipsey really like relate to me, cause uh, you know he just he just showed me what being against all odds mean. You know what I'm saying? Really like coming out the mud, coming from a, a certain territory, being being a city nigga. You know what I'm saying? You really have to beat the odds for real. You know what I'm saying? You feel a lot of emotions. You know what I'm saying? And you got to fight for what you want. And then when you're a businessman as me, you don't go for anything. So that's why it's harder. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't reaching out to no nigga. Dick Ryan, I ain't running to no label trying to beg them folk to help me or none of that shit. I'm trying to, I'm creating my own leverage by working hard every day. Okay, so what would you say makes you a businessman? Like, is it about the suits? Is it about, like, knowledge? Like, what, what makes you a businessman? My businessman is my mindset. It's, it's my negotiation skills. You know what I'm saying? My willing to um, try to 
find leverage you know what i'm saying no matter what the price is whatever you know what i'm saying my my businessman is me always trying to find a way to negotiate to come up with a solution so it don't matter i'm not you know what i'm saying i ain't boxed in i don't care what we talking about we could be talking about beats we can be talking about uh signing a deal uh we could be talking about buying a building you know what i'm saying i'm always gonna be at the table because my ability to negotiate and understand leverage so what can we expect from bank real big Shit, what y'all can expect is for me to keep going hard, putting it in your face. You know what I'm saying? Um, keep moving as a unit with my team. Um, I got more music I'm going to continue to drop. And um, just keep expanding myself, you know what I'm saying, as a person and as a team. And just keep networking, you know what I'm saying, building my brand. No label. And, you know what I'm saying, just keep growing as an individual, you know what I'm saying, and, and, and open up doors that I can pass down to my daughter and, you know what I'm saying, anybody else that's affiliated with me that's, that's deserving of the opportunity. All right, that sounds awesome. So um, before we end it, you're going to give us our social media handle and, you know what I'm saying, anybody you want to shout out? Yeah, man, um, social media, I go by Bankroll Big, you know what I'm saying, Bankroll Big, B-I-G-G. Um, that's all platforms, social media, any music platform, um, anything music related, you know what I'm saying, Bank Road B, Universal, all across the board. Um, and, man, shout out my team, man, No Label Music Group, man. Sometimes I feel like it's just us, you know what I'm saying, us and 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 just faith and and grind and hustle, man. So my team is my bottom, you know what I'm saying, me and my niggas, we, we, we together, man. We like, we like mud, we like mayonnaise, you know what I'm saying, so... We grinding together, so shout out to us, man. We putting the work in right now for this shit. You know what I'm saying? Everything else is an opportunity. But, yo, shout out to us, man, my group, man. We kicking it. We handling our business. Okay, period, yo. So, yeah, it's your girls here with the T, and we out. Came out the pot, sold a lot of dope, Gatorhood, whole Cuban link choke. I just want you to throw on, won't smoke, bank broke, big, I ain't going broke, bank broke, big, I ain't going broke, bank broke, big, I ain't going broke. Gotta cook this so you know it's trash. I ain't going broke.